Tonight we're taking a closer look at those reports of coyote sightings across Hampton Roads, especially in Portsmouth. Last night we first told you about the alert from animal control officials. So why the rise in coyotes? Ten on your sides, Robert Rizzo spent the day getting answers. On River Edge Road in Portsmouth, there's plenty of wildlife. We got all kinds of wildlife. We got eagles, fox. Steve Carroll lives in Wise Beach and has seen just about all the wildlife there is to see. I never saw the first coyote out here until two weeks ago. Oh, I've lived here 67 years and I've never seen one. But the city of Portsmouth Animal Control has recently received numerous calls about coyote sightings throughout different areas of the city. Well, you see people on Facebook commenting about it and they're all, you know, up in arms and scared. And, and I get it to a point because they're probably not used to seeing them or it's just they get a bad reputation and then people are scared of them. We have um, a large population of coyotes here in Virginia. Katie Hoffman is the bird and mammal curator at the Virginia Living Museum. And she says right now is the breeding season for the coyotes, which makes them more active as they search for a mate and more visible in residential neighborhoods. Don't leave food out for wild animals. They're attracted to that. Food out also attracts rodents, which will attract coyotes. Um, keeping um, house pets inside when possible. Coyotes will see small pets like small dogs and cats as prey. I didn't even realize we had coyotes in this area. Pat Iman has lived in Cypress Cove for 12 years. She's heard of the recent coyote sightings and now keeps a watchful eye on her 14-year-old pug, Jeb Stewart. We just need to be aware of those small pets and, and watch them like you would a child. I think they're probably more afraid of us than we are of them. If you do see a coyote in your neighborhood, you may want to keep a closer eye on your pets. Never feed a coyote and only call 911 if there's an immediate threat. In Portsmouth, Robert Rizzo, 10 on your side.